Guyana is experiencing an unprecedented economic boon as a result of its burgeoning oil industry, which is fueling significant investments in massive infrastructure projects. Guyana's newly discovered oil wealth has sparked a wave of development, prompting the country to embark on ambitious projects aimed at reshaping its landscape. These megaprojects cover a wide range of initiatives, from transformative infrastructure projects to groundbreaking developments that will shape Guyana's future. Viewers are immersed in Guyana's transformative journey in this video showcasing the country's top ongoing megaprojects. From groundbreaking infrastructure and energy projects to initiatives aimed at improving transportation, energy, and urbanization, these projects exemplify Guyana's pursuit of progress. Some projects are already changing the face of the country's skyline, while others are laying the groundwork for a more advanced and sustainable future. Each project demonstrates the country's commitment to leveraging its newfound resources to chart a course toward modernization and economic advancement. Number 13. Expansion of the Guyana International Airport The Guyana International Airport Expansion Project is the largest construction project in the country. The project will cost $1.05 billion and be completed in 2025. The new airport will have a capacity of up to 4.5 million passengers per year, up from the current capacity of 1.5 million passengers per year. The new airport will also include a new terminal building, runway, and air traffic control tower. The expansion of Guyana International Airport is a significant economic development project in the country. The new airport will assist Guyana in attracting more tourists and businesses, thereby boosting the country's economy. Thousands of jobs will be created during the project's development and operation. Number 12. Maruka Hydropower Station Guyana is constructing a new hydropower facility known as the Maruka Hydropower Facility. The factory, which is expected to cost $500 million, will be built soon. The plant's capacity will be 160 megawatts, enough to power more than 100,000 homes. The Maruka Hydropower Facility will be Guyana's largest hydropower project, reducing the country's reliance on imported oil. Guyana's Maruka Hydropower Plant is a significant environmental project. The facility will be built along the Maruka River, a major tributary of the Essequibo River. The development of the plant will necessitate the flooding of some land, but the project is expected to have a net positive impact on the country as a whole. Environment Number 11. East Banked Demirera Road Improvement Project Guyana's East Banked Demirera Road Project is a new road being built. The cost of the road is estimated to be $300 million USD. The new road will connect Georgetown, the capital city, to the Demirera East Bank. The highway will boost regional transportation and economic activity. Guyana's East Banked Demirera Road is a significant infrastructure project. The road would provide a much-needed connection between Georgetown and Demirera's East Bank, a key commercial powerhouse. The path will also improve residents' access to education and healthcare. Number 10. Bardica Highway Construction Guyana is constructing a new highway known as the Bardica Roadway Project. The cost of the highway is estimated to be $200 million USD. The new highway will connect Bardica to the rest of the country. The new road will improve regional transportation and economic activity. Guyana's Bartica Highway is a significant development project. The road will provide a much-needed link between Bartica and the rest of the country, boosting the economy of the region. The path will also improve residents' access to education and healthcare. Number 9. Expansion of the Demerara River Bridge The Demerara River Bridge expansion project entails expanding the existing Demerara River Bridge. The bridge is expected to cost $150 million. The extension will add two lanes of traffic in each direction, which will improve transportation and economic activity in the area. The extension of the Demerara River Bridge is a significant infrastructure project for Guyana. The bridge connects Thana's two most important economic cities, Georgetown and Linden. The expansion of the bridge will increase traffic and economic activity in the area. Number 8. Projects for Hydrocarbon Exploration and Production Guyana is currently undergoing a significant oil and gas boom. 
Several international corporations are exploring for oil and gas in the country's offshore seas. If these initiatives succeed, the government may be able to collect billions of dollars in cash. This will help to diversify the economy and decrease Guyana's reliance on agriculture. The oil and gas industry is expected to generate tens of thousands of jobs in Guyana. It will also help the country's economic growth and attract foreign investment. Guyana's government intends to ensure that the oil and gas industry benefits all Viennese citizens. Number 7. New Housing Initiatives the Guyanese government intends to construct thousands of additional dwellings over the next few years. This will help to alleviate the country's housing deficit and provide Guyanese residents with affordable housing. The government is working with private developers to build new homes in urban and rural areas in order to help the country grow. Single-family homes, apartments, and townhouses will be among the new housing developments. They will be energy efficient and of high quality. The government is also providing financial assistance to Guyanese citizens who want to purchase new homes. Number 6. Projects for Educational Infrastructure The government of Guyana is also investing in new schools and institutions. This will help to improve education in Guyana and provide more opportunities for Guyanese students. The government is constructing new schools in both urban and rural areas. It is also investing in school renovation and expansion. The new schools will be modern in design and will provide students with a high-quality education. The government also provides financial assistance to Guyanese students who wish to attend university. Number 5. Projects for Healthcare Infrastructure The government of Guyana is also investing in new hospitals and clinics. This would help to improve healthcare quality in Guyana and increase Guyanese access to healthcare. The government is constructing new hospitals in both urban and rural areas. It also funds the renovation and expansion of existing hospitals. The new hospitals will be outfitted with cutting-edge technology and will provide high-quality care to patients. The government is also providing financial assistance to Guyanese citizens in order for them to obtain health care. 4. Infrastructure Projects in Tourism Guyana is a relatively new tourist destination. The government of Guyanese is investing in new hotels, resorts, and tourist infrastructure. This would help to boost the Guyanese tourist industry and create jobs. The government is building new hotels and resorts in both urban and rural areas. It also makes investments in the renovation and expansion of existing hotels and resorts. The government is also working to improve the country's tourism infrastructure, such as roads, airports, and ports. Number 3. The Linden Lethem Road Project. The Linden to Lethem Road Project is a $100 million U.S. project that will be finished soon. The new road will link the town of Linden with the town of Lethem in the country's interior. The road will improve transportation and economic activity in the region, as well as make access to healthcare and education services easier. Number 2. Deepwater Port Development. The Deepwater Port project will cost $500 million and will be completed in 2025. The new port, which will be built on Guyanese Atlantic coast, will be large enough to accommodate large cargo ships. The port will boost trade and commerce in Guyanese while also creating jobs. Number 1. Project for Specialty Crop Production the Specialty Crops Production Project is a $200 million U.S. project that will be finished in 2024. The project will concentrate on high-value crops such as fruits, vegetables, and flowers. The project will aid in the diversification of the Guyanese economy and the creation of jobs. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like it and subscribe to our channel for more similar content. Tell me which mega project has piqued your interest in the comments section below. If you have any further questions about Guyanese, please ask.